Samsung. What have you done? Oh my god. Alright, so I really have something to say about Samsung. As we all know the rumors about the Samsung Galaxy S10 or S10 Plus. Uh, they will use the ultrasonic fingerprint scanner which is on screen, not on a dedicated button or a fingerprint scan on the rear. Yes, it will have a dedicated in display fingerprint scanner which uses you know, ultrasonic rather than optical. But today morning, I saw an you know, article or any other you know, social media websites or any other tech websites. Apparently, you no. Know, according to Twitter account, um, um, any low tech, I think that's what they call. I'm very sure you can see that. Uh, oh, I zoom in. <laughs> okay, never mind. Let me read it up. We have tested our cases on real Galaxy S10 phones. The in-screen fingerprint does not support screen protector, so our Vanguard will have no built-in screen protector. I was like, why man? <laughs> yes, even though the you know, optical might be useful, or you know, uh, ultrasonic is much more reliable than optical in-display fingerprint scanner like the one on the uh, OnePlus 6T or even the uh, Huawei Mate 20 Pro but I think it also at the same time less reliable as well and yes I was I think that one of the videos I also make a rant about the in display fingerprint scanner and why it's not as reliable as a regular dedicated fingerprint scanner on the wheel so yeah hopefully it's just a rumor and hopefully it only applies to tempered glass and not screen protectors you no know, even a very thin you know thin amount of the finger if that screen protector thin amount of screen protector even doesn't even work on a fingerprint reader i have no idea what they're going to be yes ultrasonic is much more futuristic and reliable but at the same time if you know i always use it i will always use tempered glass or I think a screen protector to cover my phone mm. and I guess you know because to be honest my Galaxy Note 9 at that time I I don't know how many times I use the tempered glass to you know cover my phone because you know there's some versions of a tempered glass there's a corner black border on the corner which I didn't like at all you know keep on wasted wasted that kind of weird amount just to you know get get it right on the tempered glass on the Galaxy Note 9 and you know finally I decided you know one of the stores they sell a uh, screen protector which is you now very thin not a tempered glass on the Galaxy Note 9 and this I decided to buy it and there you go at least it makes it just nice not very sure you can see it or not but yeah maybe it doesn't have a optical zoom that's why yeah can focus properly but yeah so what do you thought about the in display fingerprint scanner on the Galaxy S10 would you really want to buy a tempered glass to protect it or just take it out away and just use the futuristic features and you know hopefully it doesn't break your phone <laughs> so yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video